All right, YouTube. <clears throat> what we have here? I have this uh, range of uh, 3D printer. We're gonna have a, a little bit of review. Um, this one is a, as you can see, is a any cubic. It's a Mega S. This is my first printer. It does a job, but it's getting old and outdated. And uh, then I bought this one. It's really, really good. As you can see, the details of this printing. This, this print, this setup, this printer would would struggle to do that but this is this is how it prints right it's not too bad right like I said it does a job so this is a flash port of uh, flash forge uh, but the problem with this it's it's only take uh, fill a filament and you know that that's basically it so if you want a more a different filament this will not receive because there is not a headed bit and maybe you can get away with you know glue and stuff like that but the temperature on this is not too high this is only meant for PLA but if you want to print PLA this is a good printer right or a beginner printer this is the best my opinion so here's the settings right you got your build you got your preheat you got your tools right and this is a touch screen so you got a level this is uh, auto leveling too so this is a good thing right and you got your build so you got your it has a memory that is just, which is good you know you can select the memory all the print, uh, previous printing is here and or you have a USB comes with a USB uh, flash drive so it's right here so that that's it but it's nice it's nice printer and for this one any cubic like I said it's outdated still also a touch screen right you got your preheat. Here's your another options. You got your cooling reset, right? You got your home. If you want to print, just press print, and you got your here, right? You got your printing here, and uh, that's about with this one. But <clears throat> uh, it's. It's really hard to work on this one because you need a lot of adjustment. If you got lucky, it will print really, really good, but it depends on the day. So here's my big upgrades. So this is a Creality Ender 3 S1 Pro. Uh, it's not cheap, but you pay what you get, right? Or you get what you pay um, but it's got it's got all nice touch screen it's almost like cell phone like right and the quality of the print it's not too bad right I'm not sure if you can really good but print really really nice and this is by the way a, a ABS uh, filament and it's a direct drive which is really really nice that's what that's what I like All right he's got a light here LED light again touch screen so this is good this is done All right your print your seating, you know, you got your ABS seating here, you got PLA seating here, but this this is particular uh, 
um, machine I'm gonna only use this for um, any hard material ABS uh, uh, nylon and, and so on but if I want to print PLA I'm gonna use my flash porch because uh, that's that's a good print for PLA and yeah and that's about it so thank you for watching